All right, I think it is chasing me. So, okay, trees, get out of the way. Ouch. Oh, yeah, it's doing a lot of damage to me. This is going to be difficult. A tree, get out of the way. What's going on, guys? Welcome back to another episode of Ark the Center. Last we left off, we went on our first cave adventure. And we got our first artifact. Well, second cave adventure. We kind of went on a cave adventure. We got the artifact of the hunter. Now, if we're going to go after the bosses, we need a few more artifacts. But that's not why we're here today. And also, I tamed up this... 135 male spino. A beautiful spino, might I add. And it's got, like, really good stats. But yeah, in today's episode, it's gonna be a special one. We are finally going after my channel mascot, aka the Giganotosaurus. There was that 130 at the Volcano Island, and we are going to try and tame it. In today's video now you might be thinking oh without the d-arc you won't be able to shoot off the back of a flyer well I have a plan you see I have a backup plan boom I got this ascendant long neck rifle in a drop it has I think I think it has yeah 711 percent damage so yeah we got that and I also got some shocking trank arrows or trank darts that we got from killing those beavers and whatever. So we're going to go ahead, load these up. Now, I was thinking we could do one of two things. We could either use this to knock out the Giga, or we could use the Railgun. Now, the Railgun is specifically made for the Vecta Spinus, but you can use this on other creatures, just so you know. So we're going to go in and make ourselves that. But I think we will use the darts. I want to test that out. So we'll use the darts in this one. The next one we find, we will use the the um, rail gun. All right. So after we tame this Giga successfully, then what we might do is do some more Rex hatching. Also, I tamed up this level 20 Gigantoraptor that was right by my base. Yeah, like I tamed that off camera, and it's a female as well, so we could breed these guys up if we wanted to. I'd love to be able to get a stronger one so we could tame some babies as if uh, they were adults. That's what the Gigantoraptor's good for. But anyway, let's see, how many eggs do we have so far? Yeah, we got a good few, but we're gonna wait till we get a little more. Oh, and also off camera, I tamed another Oviraptor. So we should have a mixture of eggs with the two over raptors. So we got our egg collectors and we should be all set to go. All right, Mufasa. Let's go on an adventure. And where's the RG so we can fly over there. So as we're going there, if you do find yourself enjoying this video, make sure to leave a like and subscribe for more. It would really help out a ton. Maybe ring the bell, enable notifications and follow the social medias. And if you want to go that extra mile... No, wait, that's the uh, Giganato. That's that's my main channel. Well, in case you are following my main channel, if you want to go that extra mile, you can become a channel member. Oh, hello, Procoptodon. Level 15. I mean, I'd love to tame one of you just for the sake of taming it. But we're not here for that right now. Right now, we're going after the uh, Giga. So, all right, so it should be straight ahead. There's a wolf. That was a 145 wolf. Is that it? I think that's our... Yep, that's our guy. A level 130 giga. Time to test out what these trank arrows are all about. Alright. Yep, there he is. There's our dude. Now, he's kind of stuck... I don't want him to get knocked out in the water. 
Are you aggro to me? If you are... Yeah, that's right. Come over here. Ow, did it hit me? Alright, I think it is chasing me, so... Okay, trees, get out of the way. Ouch. Oh yeah, it's doing a lot of damage to me. This is gonna be difficult. A tree, get out of the way! That's a beautiful Rex. Eat that Rex. Get out of the way, Rexes. I'm dealing with a Giga over here. I want to test out these arrows and see how good they are. That was a miss! Eighty-five hundred. That was also a miss. Oh, we're taking a lot of damage. Ouch! Come on, Mufasa. Uh, get in my way, rocks. We're already down to half health. Even as tanky as we are, this Giga is still powerful. These trees need to get out of the way! Wait, I can jump. What am I doing? Oh, we should be good. He fell off the cliff. I think he's trying to fall off the cliff. Alright, the Giga's trying to climb back up. Alright, we have to reload. Of course we do. At least we know these arrows are good. Or darts, even. Or this rifle, even. We just keep shooting it, and it will be down in no time. This guy will require two kibble to tame. Even with 100,000 health, that Giga does serious damage. It's not even the bites, it's the bleed. It has that very powerful bleed, and now we do, like, we're at, like, half health now. Because of it. And down it goes. Awesome. I think we can reach it from up here. Up. Oh, okay, I did not want to. Great job. Let's switch over to the RG. Okay. Damn it, I didn't bring the kibble! Oh my god. How can I be so stupid? I forgot to bring the kibble! I right, just give him all that narcotic. Or is it his hitbox is pretty weird. <sighs> Alright, let me go get the kibble real quick. The good thing about that is he should be hungry by the time I get back. Actually, I should probably ping him. Alright, I found our guy. He's kind of, uh, like, inside the wall, so I had to go into ghost mode to get him. But, we, we got him anyway, so... I'll see you guys when... Our guy is fully tamed. So I will see you guys in a little bit. And there we have it. Giganotosaurus has been tamed. Let me just go into ghost mode and uh, get out of here. Alright. We got our Giga. <clears throat> now let's uh, basically get out of here and head home. Unless there's like a, a Spino nearby that we could tame. There's a Bars Boldy. At what level are you? 55? I'd love to tame one of those at some point. I'll see you guys in a little bit, unless I could find, like, a high-level female Spino. And, yeah. I'll, uh, see you guys in a little bit. There's another Giga. What level is this one? We could be going for a... Okay, it's only a 20. Alright. It's just a 20 Giga. Alright. And are you a female... I mean, you are a female, but you know what? No. No. We need another high-level female Giga if we're gonna tame it. And we're officially back at base. Let's land over here, where we can check out our Giga stats. Our channel mascot, or my channel mascot, 
You were a male. What were your stats? You had 33 points into health. Okay. 28 points into stamina. All right, that's pretty terrible. 31 points into oxygen. 39 points into food. So it looks like the highest point is into food, of course. 32 points into weight. 30 points into melee. Not the worst Giga out there, but not the greatest either. So where am I going to put you? We might, we might get a female and try to breed them up, but we might not. It's, it's a matter of whether or not we find one. Alright, so there's our Giga. I think it's like an all-white Giga. Oh, that, that looks cool. If you were a female, I'd name you Lady Regina. But you know what? I got the perfect name for you. You could be Ghost. Ghost the Giga. Alright. Let me go, uh, make up a saddle for you. There we go. How do I look? Oh, I look astounding. Wow, okay. Yeah. Yeah, I like this. I like this. Alright. We've got the saddle for the Giga. Let's take it out for a test drive. But first, let me go put some stuff away into the grinder. Ghost. I've already got a name for you. Let's go. You came out at a 194. Which isn't the greatest, but... You know what? It was a 130, so to be fair... That's some of the most amount of points you could get. I think the most you could get is 195. There's a Dodo. Let's see how much damage we do. 2,039, or that's 679. I think the 2,000 might have been the... What's it called? The 2000 might have been headshots. Or whatever. A game. 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 Thank you. I need to tame one of these protoceratops because of the food that they have. I think it's 679. Yeah. 2000, I think, is with a headshot. Alright. Let's roar. All right, I can't roar in K mode. Such a badass roar. It really is. Now, when it comes to leveling these guys up, there is no point in leveling these guys up in in anything but melee. You just want to get this guy as strong as possible. So we've got 46 levels. Let's put them What's this? Mastercraft Star Pig Saddle. Alright. Let's level that all into melee. Because there's absolutely no point in putting any points into anything else. Now we're at 240. 4300. Yep. That's about right. I'd say we'd be doing 10,000 with a headshot. Easy. Easy. Alright, let's bring this guy back. Remember, he's got terrible melee, or terrible stamina. They all have terrible stamina. The hell? A diaderma? What the hell? Let me get a, let me get a good look at you. Hold on. Oh, you're... You're like a sea urchin. Huh. You do hurt when I hit you. Ooh, what's this all about? Ouch! They're doing some damage, actually. Just by hitting them. Alright, let's hit let's head back on the Giga. Now with this Giga around, we should have a lot of protection. I mean, we got the Diamantinosaur as well. Wait, what level is this Protoceratops? A 90. I might tame one of you. I think if I get like a 140, I tamed one of you when you're actually really good. I think you guys gather fruit when you hit trees. So. Alright, we got our... Wait, do, you have, do we have like some blue on us? Or is that just the lighting? Let me see, uh... 
kind of. It's not really blue a game. Oh, thank you. Thank God. I thought the game crashed for a second. I, as I was saying, it's not blue enough where it would be distinguished. It's more of like a whitish blue. So yeah, I'm sticking with Ghost for the name. I'm sticking with Ghost. So if we can find you a girlfriend, that'd be great. Large spike taken from a sea urchin can be fired from a harpoon gun or used as a replacement for spear bolts and recipes. Huh. That's good to know. Alright, let me put the, the kibble back. And then not forget it next time we go out taming. But anyway, next on the agenda, hatch some more Rexes and Vectospinus. These guys are loud. So for the Vectospinus so far, we've got one health mutation. And for the Rexes, same thing. So for the Rexes, we're looking for 244. And for the Vectospinus, 211. So let's start with the Vectospinus. I don't know if I can carry this much. Yeah, these guys will take some time to hatch. So let's go ahead and hatch these guys up. Alright, they're all ready. So let's go ahead and uh, get them out. We've got 52 Vectospinus eggs and we can't move. Wonderful. Let's drop all the eggs. Let's see what we got. So, what level do we need? 211. Alright. 211. Nothing? Really? We didn't get any mutations from that batch. 210? 213. Sometimes you can get a double mutation. Vecta. Got plenty of 209. You're telling me we got no mutations from any of those? Are you like... Are you having a bubble? Alright, well let's put the Rexes back. 211. Yeah, no mutations. So, we'll go ahead and kill those ones. And then Rex. Wait a minute, can I just drop them? Oh yeah, this is way easier. We are looking for 244. 244. Okay, we got a couple. Alright, let's see. Let's see what we got for our mail. We got a stamina. Stamina. And uh, a food. 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 And food. Yeah, no nothing too crazy. Alright. Let's just go ahead and kill everything in that batch. So, what I'll do, I'll wait for more eggs to hatch, or more eggs to be laid, and then we'll see what happens here. In the meantime, what we could do is visit the Redwoods, just to see what's going on. Yeah, that's what we'll do. Mufasa, once again, you're coming with me. Oh, oh right, you're on the other side. You walked over to the other side for whatever reason. Off camera, something attacked the base. And, uh... The Dinosuchus walked from where it was all the way to here. I forgot about that. Alright. I would like to get a male Dinosuchus at some point. You know, just to tame one up, get an imprinted version. I'm gonna save the game just in case. Alright, I want to see what's going on in the Redwoods. So in the meantime, while we wait for more Rexes and more Vectospinus to, you know, lay eggs, we're just going to go ahead and see what's going on in the Redwoods. I'd take the RG, but the RG's relatively slow. I'd like to get a faster flyer at some point, but there aren't too many. I mean, there is the Tapahara, but they're very hard to catch. And Quetzals are super slow. Rhinos are extremely hard to tame, 
and Pteranodons don't have the best stamina or weight, and I can't shoot off the back of any of them. The D arc was just so convenient, but I can't use it till, you know, I can trust it to not crash the game right away. Hello, what are you? An Aquacanthosaurus, level 15. Sorry, buddy. You are gonna have to go. Alright, can the Dinosuchus fit inside the fence? We're about to find out. Or inside the gate, even. Can we fit? We sure can. Awesome. I'll just park you right here for now. I'm just going to quickly see what's going on in the Redwoods. See what we can find. Maybe we'll tame it like the episode afterwards. Now I believe with the acro you have to shoot it a couple times. And then once it goes into defensive mode, keep shooting until it roars and then shove narcotic down its throat. That's how you knock it out while it's roaring. Mainly I'm looking for Maraxes because I've got like an idea of how to tame the Maraxes. Those like theropod things. And they spawn in the redwoods. What do you do with these guys? Wait, well, let me just make sure I have that mod installed. I do. Okay, good. Just wanted to make sure. Because I didn't want to look for it for no reason. Alright, stop bouncing. Hello, monos. 135 mil. You do have a baby. I'm gonna grab that. Uh, hold on. There's a, another adult. Alright, where's the baby? I'm just gonna go grab this baby real quick. If you're a male, that b would be perfect. You're a male, that's perfect. Alright, I got it. Now at least we'll have a breeding pair. That's where the Gigantoraptor would come in. I keep forgetting to bring the Gigantoraptor. I haven't checked this side yet. Hello, 145 Diplo. You're not as pretty colored as the last one was. And you got a baby. I like the baby because it's gorgeous looking. Here we go. We got a Diplo. We got a Diplo. Awesome. Hello, all... Is that a... Are you a jet black spider? I mean, you got some purple. You're like the ultimate goth spider. You know what? You keep doing you. I'll keep you alive. We got a giraffe. Hello, how you doing? I would like to look for a male thorax spider. A worthy one to tame. We got a 135 female. Also with a baby. Come on. You know, screw it. They're all beautiful colors. And those are the only two I'm taming. And we got a breeding pair, right? Yeah, we do. Awesome. That works out. Alright, I will not be taming any more Diplodocus after that. Those are the only two I'm taming. I promise. Well, let's just explore the Redwoods a little bit more. And then after that, we'll head back, see if any Rex eggs have spawned, and, uh, We'll hatch some more and see if we can get some more mutations. Well, at least we got mutations with the Rexes anyway. With the Vectospinus, we didn't get any mutations at all. Hello. A level 95 Maraxis. Hmm. I would like to get something a little bit better than that, though. We could do better. We could do better. And we're back at base. Beautiful base. My beautiful base. It is really coming together. It really is. is that a, that's a Diplo right there. Level 60. Yeah, Diplos do tend to spawn here from time to time. So do these guys, the Diamantinosaurs. They don't just spawn in the Redwoods. I mean, the Redwoods is where they mainly spawn, but... Alright, let's park you in your old spot, right over here. Alright. Let's check out our... 
what was it, mono? 20, yeah, it's, it's not Cabritus, 27 point, because it's not all leveled up and whatever. It's still got its wild stats, but it's something anyway. What we could do now is get an imprinted mono. Let's, uh, let's leave you over here for now. You're kind of an orange color, too. That looks nice. Alrighty. I don't have any food on me. So let's just, uh, I guess, go in here. Alright, we'll have a Diplo here. Just because they're pretty looking. And we'll have a Diplo here. I wish you could use Medical Brew to heal your dinos. Rather than... As well as your as yourself. Alright, we got another egg. From that... You know, we'll wait for this last batch to lay eggs, and then we'll hatch them all at once. We'll start with the Vecta Spinus, and then we'll have the Rexes afterwards. Alright, all the Vecta Spinus eggs are ready. Let's go ahead. We got 12 of them. Let's hatch all 12. Now we're looking for a 211. 211. No, not at 11. 211. Really, no mutations on any of those? Alright, the Rex eggs are ready. We've got... 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. We've got 16 Rex eggs. So we're looking for a 244 with these guys. 240... No. 244. It is a female. And it's a food mutation. Ah... Uh, all right, kill them all. All right. Next episode, I'll get a trap set up and ready to go for the Bars Boldia. But until then, that's going to have to wrap it up for this episode. If you enjoyed it, make sure to leave a like and subscribe for more. It would really help out a ton. But until next time, I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching.